Salute to Oops guys, welcome back to the channel. Another day, another video, another day in the sports card world, guys. We are a few days removed from the National. If you guys were able to attend that, I hope you guys had a great time. Uh, I was not, but I am looking forward to the National in Chicago next year because I will definitely be there. It's uh, 45 minutes away from the house, so um, definitely can't wait to go to that. went to the National last year, and it was amazing, so... If, we, if I could hit a fast forward button <laughs> to next year's national, I would, but uh, we're going to have to wait it out. So I uh, haven't done a video in quite a while. was just waiting for the national to kind of come and go, but um, we are back. And uh, today we're going to be opening up uh, two of these mosaic cereal boxes uh, that I found at my local card shop. Uh, so I've never actually opened one of these cereal boxes before, but... It seemed like an interesting little product, so this should be a fun time. Also wanted to show you guys uh, some recent card pickups that I got. Um, just at some local card shows. Uh, so we'll go through the recent pickups and then we'll see what the heck we got inside these cereal boxes here. So let's just get after it. If you guys like the video, hit the like button for me, please. And if you like the video and any of my other videos hit the subscribe button we're at 437 subscribers at the salute to hoops channel and we're hoping to reach 500 by january so hopefully we can get to that it would greatly appreciate it and let's just get into this uh so i don't normally pick up WNBA, but uh as i've mentioned before i do do some sports betting and uh have actually watched a few WNBA games so i have found uh, a table that was actually selling some WNBA cards at the last card show that I went to. Uh, so I picked some up. Uh, and uh, they were actually fairly cheap. Uh, obviously, the market isn't as big as the WNBA market. Uh, but they got some good players. So uh, we got a little Jackie Young uh, Prism Auto here. Just going to go through these real quick. Brittany Griner, as we all know, she's still, uh, still over in Russia. We got the Green Prism. Little Kalia Copper, Chicago Sky's finest, been killing it. This is numbered to 299. Aja Wilson, Cracked Ice, also a beast on that Las Vegas Aces team. If you guys have ever watched them, uh, these are gonna be. This team is my favorite to probably win uh, the WNBA championship this year. They're just they got Kelsey Plum, Jackie Young, all of them. So uh, we got Sophie Cunningham. I'm not too sure what this parallel is, but she is also killing it for the. Uh, the Phoenix Mercury, and um, she was injured for a little while there, but came back, and uh, she's doing her thing, so kind of a three-point sharpshooter there for sure. Ariel Powers for the Minnesota Lynx, also killing it. This is numbered to 99, the Purple Prism. John Quill Jones, another beast uh, for the Connecticut Sun, number to 299. Then we got Sylvia Fowles. Uh, she is also a beast, um, and she's announced her retirement uh, after this coming season, so I picked this up. This is at number 299. Another Sylvia Fowles, numbered to 99, Purple Prism. And then we got some Candace Parker action. I think you don't even have to watch WNBA to know who Candace Parker is. That's numbered to 299. And then uh, Sabrina, Sabrina Ionescu, also numbered to 299. And if you know anything about her, she is just probably one of the most dominant uh, point guards, at least in the WNBA for sure. So uh, next up, we got some NBA that I picked up. We got two Kobe Whites. These are just some Donruss uh, rated rookies, nothing major here. Uh, both numbered to the 349. So 101 out of 349, and then we got uh, 242 out of 349. Uh, these are some autos and some mem cards I picked up. Uh, we got a Darko Milicic. Autofocus, UD Glass. I just liked it, honestly, because of the, I've never seen a card like this before. Um, but if you guys know the legend of Darko Milicic, uh, one of the biggest busts in NBA history for sure. I think Detroit uh, Pistons fans are still kind of reeling after that one, still feeling the effects of it. Uh, this was a dollar, uh, and I couldn't believe it. I mean, Kevin McHale and Bernard King both are uh, game-worn jersey patches. And, uh, I mean, they're both legends, especially Kevin McHale, uh, and it's numbered to 150. So I figured for $1, this is kind of definitely going to just go in my PC for sure. We got an Allen Iverson, 
uh, just a small little napkin patch. No, no big deal. I just, uh, was a huge fan of Allen Iverson when I was a kid. Clay Thompson, fabric of the game. Uh, this is before Panini started getting kind of uh, shysty with the patches. So this is actually player, or sorry, game worn, and this is number two, one ninety nine. Kurt Rambis, auto. Don't know why I got this. Honestly, uh, we got Steve Francis, one of my also one of my favorite players when I was growing up. Prism, this number two ninety nine. Kevin Garnett, little napkin patch. Nothing major there, but once again, just a huge fan of his when I was a kid. Uh, we got a tri patch, all napkins, unfortunately, but uh, this is number to 249. We got Ben Gordon, Chris Duhon, and then Ben Wallace. As a Chicago Bulls fan, I felt obligated to pick this card up. And then last but not least, we have a swatch of uh, Trace McGrady and then uh, Mike Miller. So uh, on the back, it actually says this is the... Uh, from this is from the All Star Game, I believe. So definitely a pretty cool patch to have, and adding to it, just a huge Trace McGrady fan when I was a kid. So definitely some cool pickups there. And then we can get into these cereal boxes. Uh, this should be interesting. I've never opened these before, like I said. So I don't even know what we're expecting when we open it. Okay, so it's like a hanger package there. What we got all right Sabonis Bertans RJ Barrett Brogdon Danny Green Yaka Pirtle D'Lo just some just some base mosaic at the moment Mason Jones rookie Anthony Day to Day Davis. We got Malachi Flynn, Aaron Neesmith, Zeke Naji, and then let's see. We got Jaron Jackson Jr., Jamal Murray, Jalen Brown, Andre Drummond, the newest Chicago Bull. I can't wait to see him on our team. Peyton Pritchard, NBA debut. Uh, Gary Trent Jr. I'm not too sure what this parallel is, but not numbered or anything like that. Darren Fox, little Derrick Rose, Blue Chips, Peyton Pritchard, Joel Embiid, and then we have a montage, Gordon Haywood. Hayward, sorry, excuse me. All right, nothing too crazy in that one. Let's go for the second one here. Throw that right there. All right, we got Brooke Lopez, Buddy Heald, Miles Turner. We'll kind of go through the base pretty quickly here. Luke Kennard, Ben Simmons, Malik Beasley, Ennis Cantor, Sam Merrill, rookie, Obi Topin, NBA debut, Jaden McDaniels, rookie, Allen Iverson, James Harden, Karis LeVert, Landry Shamit, Keldon Johnson, Kelly Olenek, Steve Nash, Malik Beasley, Jokic, Booker, okay, and then we got Derrick Rose Montage. All right, nothing too crazy in there. We just got some base rookies, a little bit of color with the Peyton Pritchard, but um, I've, I have heard some good things about these, so I had decided to take a chance on these. were 45 bucks each, so nothing too crazy. Uh, they did have um, the Prism Hobby packs to open. Uh, but I can't, I can't really fathom paying $110 a pack for those. So that concludes the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. A little bit, a little mix of everything in here, both NBA and WNBA, some singles, autos, and then we got some pack opening. So boom, we are out of here, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for the support. Hit the subscribe button if you like what you see. I would greatly appreciate it. I will see you on the next one. Take it easy.